And this be from Cash, not from YouTube. I'm in love with you, girl, and I don't want anything for you to know. Fall, take a shot, now I'm cut by me. Honey, grass, spank, that's the Louis Star. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Jada, a.k.a. Jada Allure, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome, and welcome to Vlogmas episode 4. It is finally time for my maintenance vlog. Today is Friday. It's December 29th. As of right now, it is 6.30 in the morning. I've been working today. I've been working yesterday. I've been working the day before that. I've just been getting a lot of money, which I'm really happy for, but I am tired, y'all. Tomorrow, I'm booked out. I, I'm not going to finish my day until 12 in the morning. And guess what time I got to start? 10 a.m. And it's 6 o'clock. I know I'm going to be tired. I still haven't slept yet from like two days ago, like a day and a half ago. And right now, I am about to install my wig. I've been waiting to install this wig for so freaking long. For today, hair, tomorrow, lashes and nails oh my god y'all i just can't wait for y'all to see like i can't wait for y'all to see before i install this wig i want to say thank you to shein for sending me this beautiful 34 inch 150 density 13 by 4 lace wig now this wig was black i dyed this wig i bleach bathed it once and the color lifted really really well and then i dyed it red and the color took really really well as y'all can see like it just looks beautiful so if you want to get a wig like this and you want money off don't forget to use my code wig waiter when you go purchase your wigs for Shein for money off so this is my little setup that i have i got my wax stick my mousse that i use for my edges bio silk kj glue this is like the best glue ever even spray i have my cap scissors my makeup brush razor clips this is the foundation that i use cream foundation in the color rd16 and then i have both combs i use a taper comb for my edges and this comb just for like parting and flat iron and stuff i have my brush and my elastic band and i have my ipad here just so that we could play some vibes so I'm gonna get started on my hair and I will see y'all in the next clip.
bang they brenda they be trying to hit the o up thank you lord to talk to vernie break your bosom bitch when you say the opposite you couldn't get it ain't no killers no more you back door man you get from real bitch i fuck 300 i'm the first one with a lamb truck yeah i know a trip they think they cut us to his head then we out it the killers and robbers I'm in the ex, I might hit up the gun. Gotta check and not share no more. Don't get a thing on the chop. y'all so it is 9 41 and i am finally finished with my hair as y'all can see i did a nice regular side part i wanted to to be a little bit deeper but this front is not a full 13 by 4 it has like those one inch sides so i'm gonna stand up so y'all can see how long the hair is and i'm 5'2 and this is how long the hair is on me it comes down here Alright y'all, so today is now the 30th, it's the next day, it's Saturday, I'm exhausted, like it's 8 in the morning and I am so freaking tired. Okay. Let me tell y'all how my last couple of days have been going. Three days ago, I didn't sleep and two days ago, I didn't sleep. So I was up for basically like two days. Two days ago, I was working and I didn't finish my last client until like five, going on six. And then I had a client yesterday, which you saw, you know, so two days ago ran into yesterday. So I had a client that I finished at six o'clock yesterday morning, but I also had a fully booked day yesterday and it was starting at 10 o'clock in the morning. I wouldn't have had no time to do my own hair because I have clients on clients on clients. Today, I have to go to like my appointments and stuff. I was up literally on my feet from 10 a.m. to probably like one in the morning like and it's not like i want to sleep comfortably i want to sleep and just plop myself on the bed and end up waking up at eight o'clock in the morning i'm about to hop in the shower freshen up and stuff and then i'm going to go back in my room and wait for my 10 o'clock client to come because i do have a 10 o'clock client today and then we're going to go to my lash appointment which is at 12 30 and uh, well before i go to my lash appointment actually i have to take my clothes to the laundry so that i can drop them off and that they can wash them and then i have to go to my lash appointment and i have to take my pants that i'm wearing on new year's eve to get tailored because they're too big around the waist and then after that we're gonna go to our nail appointment for my nail appointment we're gonna come back and then i'm going to a concert today but that's going to be in a totally separate vlog that's going to be in my new year's vlog so don't forget to go watch my new year's vlog if you haven't already all right y'all so right now it's one o'clock i'm on my way to my last appointment i'm running late i'm not really running late because the 10 minutes is 15 miles late i'm not really worried about that because she literally lives like right around the corner i was supposed to be taking my clothes to the laundry i was also supposed to take my pants that i'm wearing on ears to the clean i mean to the tailor i literally didn't even have enough time to pack my clothes up 
and get what I needed to get together so that I could do what I had to do. And I couldn't even eat my food. I had to pack it in a Tupperware so I could take it with me to my last appointment and eat it while I'm there because y'all, I'm hungry. I didn't eat nothing. I woke up at 10 o'clock this morning and I had a client. Well, I didn't wake up at 10 o'clock actually. I woke up at seven o'clock. I had my client. I didn't eat nothing yet. So my dad made some grits and sausage. And that's what I'm about to do. You, this motherfucker. Damn. Because I love me some grits. That's one thing I'm going to eat is some grits. Alright y'all, so it's literally 2.20 and I'm done with my lashes. I've been done with my lashes since like 2 o'clock. Do y'all see the perfection? I just love my lash tech. She moves so fast and her retention game is like top tier. So I'm going to put her name on the screen or her Instagram on the screen somewhere. Right now I'm going back in my house because I have to pack my clothes so I can take them to the laundry. Also take my pants that need to be tailored to the tailor but it's for reason outside sounds like this is when i really wish i had a car but i'm gonna get one soon all right y'all so i'm back in my room and right now i'm cleaning up my vanity because i had a client before i left this morning so like i was rushing after that so i didn't really get no time to clean up so now i'm just cleaning up after this, I have to pack my clothes so that they can go inside of the laundry bag that I'm taking to the laundry so that I'm dropping my clothes off to them. I'm like, I'm not washing my clothes. I'm gonna let them wash it for me. Anyway, I'm about to fly iron my hair, pack up my bag, and then go on and get my nails done after that. I, I have to see if my cousin is still gonna take me to go get my nails done because he was supposed to drop me but he ended up going exactly by where i needed to go to get my nails done but he went like od early my nail appointment isn't until 5 it's like 3 30 right now i'm kind of just sitting here waiting for time to pass by but i have i have other stuff to do so i'm probably gonna see y'all when i go get my nails done i also need to go get my feet done and my eyebrows done but I don't think I'm going to be able to do that today. I'm probably going to have to do that tomorrow after my client. Because tomorrow, or early in the morning before my client. Because tomorrow is New Year's Eve. Like when I'm really, really going out. So, I don't know. But I'm about to do what I have to do. And I'll be back. Alright y'all, so right now I'm at the tailor and on my pants so that he can see how much he has to do. I really should have been brought them, but it's whatever. You got this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I need it. Like snatching, like this. So, yeah. Just waiting for him to tell me how much. And I gotta pick it up tomorrow by like 5. So, yeah. I just dropped my clothes off, I mean my pants off to the tailor. Not gonna lie. If y'all in, in New York and need your pants tailored, do not go to Lords of um, Tailoring. They are very rude and very disrespectful. I was supposed to go to a totally different one because 
like that's where my dad had told me to go and then they told me they wouldn't be able to do it for tomorrow i'm like okay and then i just went up the block because it was one of the block and then i get in there and the man was like i wasn't really pressed about the pins being too big because they could have hung down my waist like i really wouldn't care i asked them if he could do it he said no i said okay i was leaving out and he was like um what do you actually want done to the pins and i was like i just want it taken in on my waist a little bit like it's not even that much he was like okay let me see so i showed him the pants he was like try them on here's the root part this lady comes from the back she's like um so what do you want to done to your pants and i'm like i just want the back taken i want it to like match my waist and she's like um when do you need the pants on i said tomorrow she said well we're not gonna be able to do that and i said but like she's talking but she's like walking away from you so then the man is like um i told her i was gonna do it and she was like oh okay i didn't know you spoke to him so then after that um she she ties me up or whatever she pins my pants together to see like what they need to do with my pants and after she's done she's like okay you know, and i'm like all right and i'm getting ready to walk into the um dressing room but i'm still looking that way like i'm just looking at stuff around the store she's like you can go change and i'm like who like who, who the fuck are you talking to her like, yeah i know i'm going to do that right now like who you to? like i know i could go change but i don't want to stay in your damn store i got other things i have to do i don't know i'm on way to get my nails done now i really don't know what to do with my nails every time i get my nails done i always do like white black silver time and a french tip i think i want to try like duckies today we're gonna see when we get there.